What's going on? We got another uh, reviews with Josh video now. And uh, today we're gonna uh, be reviewing a uh, propane stove here. Ozark Trail. This is the cheapest one I've been able to find. I think it was about $18. Uh, so if you're at a cheap option, if you want a cheap option, this is it. So we're gonna give her a test and see how it goes. So here she is. We're gonna go ahead and unbox it and see what we got going on inside. Instructions. Don't need that. Here's the actual stove. Looks pretty nice to me, anyway. And then this is the base for the propane tank. Looks like it has some flip out stabilizers. So then, just gonna set your uh, propane tank right in there. Keep it sturdy. Then you got your uh, plus and minus there. I guess this does not have an igniter, so you will need to get a lighter in order to use this, I believe. All right guys, so I found a lighter, so I'll be able to light it. So we're just gonna screw her on here and uh, see how it goes. Pretty simple. And uh, just gonna turn on the knob a little bit, I guess. You can hear the gas coming out. Just light it. That's on a really low setting. Turn it up all the way. Looks like it's got some power to me. Now this is a pretty big surface, so you'll be able to uh, cook with a skillet or a pot. Uh, right now what I have is a little cup. And the cup does not fit on there well, I'm gonna be honest. So, might need something a little bigger to cook on. But I think it'll work. So we're just gonna put some water in here and see how it does with the boil water. And it is heating up, so I'm gonna get off here and put on a timer and see how long it takes to boil. So we're right at about two minutes since we started the water. And uh, it's starting to bubble a little bit. As you can see, it is very hot. I do not suggest using this cup. It barely fits on the burners. So you could potentially knock it over and spilled burning hot water on yourself so if you're going to use this particular one i would get a pot or a skillet but uh it heats up very very fast probably approaching close to three minutes now and it is on you know borderline boiling so if you need to heat up your water this sucker is going to do it quick oh yeah Well, turn it off. The handle there was a little bit too hot to grab. <laughs> so this was my only way to get it off there, had to turn it off. Overall though, this thing works very well. I like the nice stable platform. And uh, I think for most people, this is gonna work just fine. If you need to use water to rehydrate your food, cook some ramen, make some coffee, this thing's gonna heat it up real fast. Steaming hot water, too hot to grab with your hands. Just about burnt myself. Uh, this thing works very well, but like I said, you're gonna want something a little bigger than this cup because it just barely fits. Uh, I would use just a little skillet or a slightly bigger cup. But this is going to be great for camping in my tent when I don't want to sit outside in the cold to cook.
Well, guys, this was kind of a shorter video, but wanted to show that off and let you guys know what I think. I uh, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, stay tuned for more videos and reviews. Uh, go check out my other camping videos if you like, and uh, give me a subscribe. Feel free to share.